Hi everyone. In today's tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to use LED player to program effects by using the SN510 controller. It is mainly used in outdoor lighting effects, such as shopping mall, pavilion, and multi-building linkage. Now let me dive into LED player software and program the effects. You can follow the steps to use LED player software. Firstly, we can click Project New to create a new project. Next, we need to fill in the project name, project size, and project path. Then we click New Map Tools for Project. Now we can see the map tools. We can use it to create mapping on this page according to the project's needs. We will set up mapping size, controller settings, chip settings which contains chip type, and channel sequence. Then we click Confirm. We can import DXF directly here, or create mapping like this. Our map tools also support creating complex and beautiful mappings like this. When we are done mapping, close map tools and click save. Then we select corresponding net card. If we want to use it online, we should make sure that the controller is connected to the computer. We need to connect one end of the network cable to the ethernet input of the controller and connect the other end to the computer. Do not forget to connect SN 510 and Yin 508. Before selecting, we should open the network connections. Right-click Ethernet, click Property. Find the IPv4 and click the property. On this page, we choose Use the following IP address and fill in all information, which can be found on the side of the controller. Then we confirm and save. So we can click Confirm to choose Net Card. Select the one we just set and save. After selecting net card, we click yes. It will switch to output mode. Now, let us choose the suitable effects. For choosing the effects, we come here on material to choose different kinds of effects, like simple animation, test animation, and build-in animation. We can choose some effects like build-in animation one. And click confirm. After loading, click yes to add as a program. We can also choose some test effects, which we use to test mapping and lamps. In addition, we can add a video to generate a corresponding effect. We can see the effects were added in the list on the left of the software. For controlling lamps online, we need to make sure that we have already switched to output mode. Then we select an effect and click play. So we can see the LED panel is rotating and our LED player software is rotating too. Now we can change the effect, and we can see the LED panel is changing synchronously. Let us try more effects to see this control online. In addition to this, our controller also supports using offline by SD card. We come here on Output, click SD. Select the normal programs we need and click Output. When it finished, we click Yes. Choose the SD card and confirm. And wait until it succeeds. Now we can put the SD card into our controller like this. So we can select effects in SD card directly. In addition, we can also adjust the speed and cycle mode. It is really easy to use LED player software. That is all about using our software with the controller SN510. Thank you for your time. See you on the next tutorial video.